Hello, X-Horse fans. If you need vehicle diagnostics, don't miss this product. MVCI Pro J2534 Vehicle Diagnosis Programming Cable Supports Multi-Vehicle and Multi-Protocol. Powerful and cost-effective, it is a perfect substitute for original hardware. It's designed to meet mainstream automotive industry standards, compatible with DPDU and J2534 for diagnostic standards. It supports multiple automotive manufacturers, such as Audi, Lamborghini, Bentley, Volkswagen, Toyota, Honda, Ford, Subaru, Mazda, etc. And it supports various communication protocols, such as CAN, CUN, PS, ISO 15765, etc. These original diagnostic software are currently compatible, and more supported types will continue to be updated. After connection, click Connect in the MVCI Pro software to view device information, such as firmware version number, serial number, etc. Click here to read the device authorization status and available times. Click here to update the latest authorization status and reset the available times. In vehicle diagnosis, we can also install the driver required for the corresponding brand, so that the operation on the original diagnostic software is successful. In addition, we can perform software upgrades and firmware upgrades here. For Volkswagen, this programming cable supports PDU protocol and can replace the AS6154. If you need to replace it, you can open the MVCI Pro software, enter vehicle diagnosis, select Volkswagen, uninstall the existing driver first, and then click install. Click yes to install the 6150 for mode that is compatible with the PDU protocol. Click no to install the 5050 for mode that is compatible with the Pastu J2534 for protocol. So click yes to finish the installation. Next, I will take Honda as an example to show you how to use the diagnosis programming cable to view and clear diagnostic trouble code. First connect the cable between the vehicle module and the computer. Open Honda original diagnostic software and it will automatically read the VIN number. If the VIN number hasn't automatically filled in, we should check whether the cable connection is successful. If the OBD voltage is detected, the signal light will be solid green. Complete the info and continue to the next step. Click Honda system to start diagnostic, and here will provide a list of systems. For example, we click one push start keyless access control unit, and open DTCS. Then here will display the diagnostic trouble code and related description. Now it's time to clear the code. Click the fourth icon on the right, then press enter button to clear DTCS. Okay, now the diagnostic trouble code cannot be queried. Next we can use the same method to diagnose other systems. If you have any questions or topics of interest, please leave a comment. See you in our next video.